Uh, what is up, everybody? Welcome to the Autoblog live stream. My name's Eric. I am the multimedia producer here at Autoblog, and I am joined today by Autoblog green editor John Snyder. What is up, John? The opposite of down, Eric. We've had this conversation. <laughs> that is uh, technically true, which I guess is, <laughs> is the best kind of true. <sighs> no, things are good. Busy, busy day around here. You know, the uh, virtual CES is today. And um, yeah, that's we were right. lucky enough to, to be on, on the uh, Engadget virtual stage this morning talking about uh, GM's electric revolution. Yeah. How, yeah. How, how was that? And and is that I know that will be available for people to watch soon. Do you know if it's up yet or it just will be soon? It's not up, not up yet. You might be able to watch the replay like on on Engadget, but we're we're still, uh, you know, broad. uh, uh, I don't know what the word is. Fiddling with uh, the 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 clips for for our users. Yes. Indeed. Nice. And for some reason, Rocket League is taking forever to load on my PlayStation, so I'm gonna all close good. That. We're Close gonna. App and... I'm 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 uh, taking advantage of some of the, the new PC magic here. So we got all new train, all new PC trainings and everything. Mm-hmm. Um, which you cannot get on console. That I think are pretty cool. Yeah, look at you go. Uh, what's up, Gamer King? Yes, you you can join. Did we ever f- figure out? Did we ever figure out how we could be friends, or do we have to go into the? Um, if we have to go into the the private match, that's fine. Oh, that was a close one. Uh, but yes, you can absolutely join Gamer King. This is a good omen because I feel like I'm absolutely crushing this uh, this giant rings right now. Yeah, that looks not like the easiest thing in the world. And believe it or not, this <laughs> this is one of the easier ones because the rings are so huge. There we go, nailed it, nailed it. Um. Parskev, hello, says, can I play this on PS4? Yes, this game is uh, available for... Oh, oh, my fault. This training you cannot play on PS4. Uh, Rocket League, the game, you can play on PS4. But this training is uh, is PC only. Um, this is a Steam, a Steam Workshop training by the legend Lethemir. He makes a lot of these crazy... Uh, uh, modified Rocket League things. Yeah, I won't go back to the main here. Uh, Raging, what's up, Raging? Says, want to play tournament? Nah, we probably can't really do a tournament today. Just because, um, yeah, you know, I like if people want to hop in and, and play, I want to give people the opportunity to do that. Uh, and if we're in a tournament for an hour, obviously we can't do that. Um... But the the Bjorkly, <laughs> that's a funny name. What's up? I love it. I am a fan. And 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 Kalib, I'm not sure if I said hello, but hello, Kalib. Um, man, lot, lots of people stoked for Rocket League today. Uh, I'd be stoked if uh, my thing would load, but I think I'm gonna switch to my Switch. Okay, sure. Uh, whoa, Lord Baltimore, what's up? Haven't seen you in a while. Hey, How, how's been it been? While. Yeah. How have you been? John's here as well. I hope you've been doing well. The Bjorkley says, I'm Norwegian. Very cool. Mr. Kal- Kalashnikov. Uh, oh, I think, thank you for the, uh, thank you for the follow. Um. Love, love having an international crowd. Yeah, for sure. Alex Alex is here. What's up, Alex? 
Alex says, I might be playing. I don't know, though. All right. So let's try. So Gamer King. Uh, let's see if my Epic Games is no longer useless. And let's see if we can just add people. Um, Francisco. What's up, Francisco? Uh, and Beth Cosgro. Um... Emmanuel says, can we party? So we can... I, I'm definitely down to play with whoever. Um, but uh, we can only have... We can't have anybody in the voice chat, though. But definitely down to uh, definitely down to play with whoever. Um, ah, that rank thing is actually outdated. Um, I'm now Diamond 1, Diamond 2-ish. Alex, Beth says, I left a like and subscribe. Thank you, Beth. Um, Alex says, is that a different kind of Octane? Yes, this is a painted Octane ZSR. This is my favorite car in the game. Um, I love it. I absolutely love it. Actually, I feel like I had a different, I had some interesting looks lately, I feel like. What do we got here? This one's not good, I don't think. Yeah, this one's boring. This one's kind of sick. Um, this one's okay. Oh, that one's the same on both. Yeah, we'll go with the we'll go with the classic with the uh, the white Cristianos here. Um, <laughs> Mister says uh, titanium white octane party. Uh, I love it. So, okay, so here's the thing, guys, though. So, first of all, wow, there's a lot of people here early. That usually doesn't happen. Second of all, my Epic Games account uh, is very often, if not always, broken. And it says that my friends list is full. But it's obviously not full because, as you can see here, I have 19 friends total. So it's just broken. Uh, it, it's, it's unnecessarily difficult. So here's what we're going to do. If you want to try to party up, first thing, you guys just try to add me. It might say my friends list is full, but you got to try. Um, and as you can see up in the upper right hand corner, it's just Skyway traffic, one word. Uh, and I'm not sure, are there no longer numbers on Epic IDs? I guess maybe there's no longer numbers on Epic IDs. Uh, Boss Cuber's here. What's up, Boss Cuber? Yep, uh, Raging says, what's your epic? Yep, it's Sky Skyway Traffic. Yep, all one word. Nail nailed it, Gamer King. Thank you. Alex says, you can just invite me from Xbox, right? I cannot, because I'm on a PC. Um, and, and I'm, not, like, not signed into any of my Xbox stuff. Um, raging. So my epic is Skyway Traffic. And actually, um, all right, Emmanuel. So we're gonna see if we can get uh, Emmanuel. All right, I sent an invitation to Sharp Buffalo. Mister says I'm uh, doing a ranked CS:GO match. I'll be back. Sounds good. Good luck. R4 Dog says, "Can I please play with you? If we can get it working, yes. But uh, but uh, I've been having a lot of trouble actually trying to get this to work." Um, right, I've invited you to a party, okay. and I'm going to then make you leader. I switched to my Switch, because my PlayStation is being a brat. No problem. But Lord Baltimore. Oh, go ahead, John. Go ahead. Always good to have a backup. Yes, definitely. <sighs> so it's still saying the user reached the maximum number of friends, which obviously is not true, because I have 19 friends. That is in furiating <laughs> my god you know what hold on you guys uh, bear with me for two minutes here i'm sending epic support an email r literally right now live on stream because <laughs> this is this is actually absurd <laughs> <laughs> 
This is actually absurd. I so, so clearly... Oh, who is someone? Someone just sent me a party invite. I'm gonna I'm gonna accept someone's party invite. Wait, Sharp Buffalo, it says we're friends. How does how does that work? It said that my it said it told you that uh How did you get it to work? Oh, that was Emmanuel. That was a different person. How did you get it to work, Emmanuel? Please, please let us know in the chat how you got it to work. Because you're the first person who's been able to add me as a friend in, like, weeks. Marley Phillips, what's up, Marley? KT, what's up, KT? Uh, Maxo Gaming says, "Do you play Fortnite?" Not really. You need to reinvite me to the party. Yes, I will reinvite you to the party. I just sent an invite. All right, everybody. All right, we have an extremely low tolerance for spamming. Everybody needs to stop spamming. If you keep spamming, you're going to get banned. Everybody needs to stop spamming. Um Oh, I love um, Musty or Sunless. I mean, I'm a Sunless guy. So I'm going to add Sunless. Did you get uh my party invite, John? Let me see. I just sent another one. Oh yeah, here we go. All right, so any thank thank you for setting this up, Emmanuel. This is awesome. So if anybody wants to play, just uh go join the uh, custom game. The name is Gamer, all lowercase, and there's no password. So just go ahead and. Uh, and and hop in that game if you want to play. We'll all get partied up and we'll uh we'll have some fun here. You like partying up and having fun? I do. I like it more when it actually works. But Did you get my invite at all, John, by the way? Marley says, can I play with you? Yes, but you have to do what I just said. Okay, Marley, if you keep spamming, you're going to get banned. I'm sorry. You got to stop. That's so annoying. Okay, I'm in. I'm in. I'm in. I'm in. Good, 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 good stuff. Um, the Bjorkly says, I'm, I'm new to Twitch. Nice. Well, welcome. Welcome to Twitch. And the Bjorkly is following. Thank you, Bjorkly. That is much appreciated. And also, Alex's adv advice is very good. So if if I don't see it and you, and you really want me to see it, just wait a little while and try again. But yeah, no no need to <laughs> no need to drop hellos with a million O's and stuff like that for sure. Uh, popcorn frog, what's up, popcorn? Thank you for the follow. Gamer King's in. Good stuff. Good stuff. So we got. Me and Gamer King are the Sunless Con boys here.
Star Wars. Star Wars. I want to get it for anybody who doesn't know who isn't a giant nerd about Star Wars. Star Wars just uh, just released. Uh, it's like they they're doing this whole uh, all these stories in like a new time period. It's like hundreds of years before Luke Skywalker. I'm trying to really dumb this explanation down for anybody who has no clue what we're talking about. Um, but it's very exciting for Star Wars fans like me and John. And they just released the first. Uh, I mean, they're doing. They're going to be doing books, comics, video games, all of that in this new like big storyline. And I'm very stoked about it. Very, very stoked about it. Uh, and John, you said you've been reading the first book already, right? And it's yes, good. Yes, I have been. Nice. Yes. Very good. I don't know how, but I'm I'm still in the men the menu. What do you mean? <laughs> You're playing, right? Y yeah, yeah. But we're in. Can you join a custom game? Can you join this custom game? Um, Alex says. <laughs> Alex says you actually saying that was good advice felt weird. I mean, it. It's just. It's just like common courtesy, you know what I mean? It's like if you, uh, like, the way to get a streamer's attention is not by spamming, I promise. At, we all hate it. 100% of us hate it. Nobody thinks it's funny. Nobody doesn't think it's annoying. Uh, but, like, but like, if you wait a little by, while and just, like, re-say what you said, I, I feel like that's fine. I feel like most people think that's totally fine. So that's good advice, Alex, for sure. Um... Red Mayhem is here. What's up, Red? Says, I have seen you playing, and I like the way you play. You play like Lund. I'm not sure if I'm super familiar with Lund. Um, someone here. says, after this, we'll play a new game mode. Perfect, someone. No, yeah, this is great. Just give people time to join. Um, this is perfect. And someone says, if he wants to join, he should go to custom games, private yeah, match. Man. Yep, nice, 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 nice. And then Alex says, uh, Bjorkley says, I like you, Autoblog. Thanks, Bjorkley. I like you, too. And uh, Alex says, I just realized I've been watching you for, like, six months. That is wild. Well, I really appreciate it. We we, uh, we all do over here at Autoblog. I hope, uh, I hope you find it entertaining. Uh-oh, Marley left. And uh, Alex says, and I never knew your name. Really? I feel like I never... Well, yeah, I, I think I, I say my name at the beginning of uh, of every stream, I feel like. But yeah, my name is Eric. Um, Did you say it's... it's You got it, John, or no? Oh, yeah, yeah you're in here. Nice. Yeah. Nice, nice. Where did Mar- I'm bummed Marley got kicked. Gamer King says, sorry I didn't- Oh, no worries, Gamer- I don't think we're really, like, playing for- We're just kind of playing- Messing around right now. I don't think this is, like, a serious game yet. We're just like- So, FYI, we got five minutes left in this little, uh... Join the party thing. So, if you want to join- Join now or forever hold your peace. You got five minutes. Um, and, and we'll do it. You know, we can. We'll do another one of these a, a little bit later to get anybody else in. Um, but, but I mean, for right now, if anybody wants to play right now. Alex says, if you see some random text, it's Romanian, and I'm typing a text to later put in my notebook thing, you can just delete it if it happens. I, all right, I'm not, <laughs> wait, why are you, why are you using a Twitch chat to like, to type stuff to put in your notebook? I see what you're saying. I see. I got you, Alex. I got you.
<laughs> oh yeah! Yeah. <laughs> uh, and yes, um, Lord Baltimore, I read this and said it in my mind, but didn't say it with my mouth, uh, says he's Eric the half a bee, which is a... That's a Monty Python. Python. Yeah, 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 Monty yeah. Python. Reference. Thank you, Emmanuel, says if anyone wants to join, the name is Gamer with no password. And, and once again, I really appreciate you setting this up, Emmanuel. It definitely makes my life a lot easier. It is much appreciated, and you are awesome. Thank you. Whoop. I got you, Alex. I got you. Half my screen is Twitch, the other half is Word. By the way, did you guys... Uh... You guys uh, peep the new banner flare there. Finally got a tournament win. Took long enough, but I finally got one. Oh, oh yeah. that's good. Nice hit, Eric. Oh, nice steal, someone. Thought I had you there for sure. my first time playing this and uh i think since uh nice shot last, Gamer King. last time i streamed with you uh, wow yes yeah, like, so it's been a little while yeah. um Ro roxy i must i assume this is pronounced roxy hello roxy what's up welcome Oh, wow. That's my bad. I for sure should have saved that. Not sure what I was doing there. Roxy says, do you have titanium white fennec? I do not. I do not. This is, in fact, I think this is the only titanium white vehicle. Uh, I might have like a titanium white mudcat or something from a, uh, from a rocket pass, but. Fennec Shan? Let's go. <laughs> no, not that Fennec. <laughs> <laughs> Everything is Star Wars here. Yes, it is. That is true. By the way, everybody, how is the audio mix here? Um, can everybody hear... Is John too low versus the game audio? Can you guys hear me okay? Um, let me know and I can tweak stuff. Alex says, the audio is better than the last stream. That's definitely for sure. Okay, that's good. That's good. Yeah, just let me... Like, always just let me know if the audio is bad, and I, and I can fix it. I mean, it's never... It's never an issue. Oh, we got Christopher. What's up, Christopher? Am I... Uh, that is Lord Baltimore. Right, Baltimore? I know I'm kind of speaking in weird code, I just, I, I really try hard not to dox people. <laughs> so, even though we know who you are, I, I'm trying to... Is it 666 Baltimore Lane in Baltimore, Maryland? <laughs> That's true! <laughs> 666, oh man! <laughs> six six five, the neighbor of the beast. Ah, there we go. Oh wow, let's go. All right, good. My memory is not completely gone. That's good. That's a good sign. Uh, Roxy says, "Do you know anyone that does?" I do not, unfortunately, Roxy. I'm sorry. <clears throat> that's a cool looking car, though. That's for sure. I like the trade white or the titanium white Fennec. But yeah, this is my this is my baby right here, the white uh, Octane ZSR. Okay, so since we're getting close to the end of this uh, game, where we're getting people in here, let's have everybody drop their. Um, just let me know what rank you everybody is. 
And if you're unranked, just say, I'm unranked. Um, but since we have an right. uneven number of players, I want to I wanna try to keep the teams as close as possible. Still unranked. Still unranked? Okay. Yeah, I, 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 don't, I don't know. Yeah. Oh, no big deal at all. Someone seems pretty legit. Someone seems... Yeah, for sure. That last goal was... Yeah. Sick. Oh, man, look at this! Look at this! Showing off a little bit! Oh, man. Yeah, some someone's legit, for sure. Look at this. Um, Alex says, My baby is a Ronin GXT with red wheels and a cyan body. Ooh. Yeah, I bet that looks really cool. Um, thank you for the follow, Fire, Fire RL, Fire Rocket League, I love it. Um, Lord Baltimore said, I can't stick around, just wanted to play something for a minute. Oh, all good. Sweet, sweet. All good, yeah, just, uh, oops, sorry, Gamer King, sorry, 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 that was my fault. Um, Alex says on, he said he likes that one on blue and on red, it's a really cool livery and, um, oh, and the tournament wheels from last, the exotic tournament wheels from last season. Gamer King says, I was gold late season one, but now I'm silver. Okay, okay. You will be back up to gold in no time, Gamer King. I'm, I'm so, I'm super sure. Oh, someone tying it up with the buzzer beater. <laughs> Alex, thank you for letting me know, Alex. I did not realize how weirdly my uh, my face cam was positioned. <laughs> That's funny. Oh wow! I thought we were gonna get uh, I thought we were gonna get lucky and it was gonna pause at the at the hit there. Yeah. Nice shot. Roxy says I'm just so mad. Why, Roxy? What's wrong? Yeah, look at that. 24. <laughs> Love it. Someone carried this. Ah, <laughs> uh, yeah, Roxy says, I'm trying to get a titanium white fennec, but everyone just tries to scam. Have you... Tr I'm, you probably have, Roxy, but it, just in case you haven't, have you... Like, there are some websites that, like, set up... Um, Uh, like they they basically like set up trade like you find people to trade with through these websites. Someone says want to go or leave. Uh, so um, who is everybody in this? I feel like we're missing someone from this party. We're still missing Gamer King from this party. Can we? How can we get Gamer King in here? Fire Rocket League says, "What y'all playing?" Um, I, I mean, no, we're just kind of, just kind of having fun. We're just uh, playing, playing around here. And, and and I'm I'm always down to do some hoops for sure. Oh, this is <clears throat> this is new to me. Have you not done hoops yet, John? I don't think so. This is fun. So the main thing, I mean, one of the main things you have to worry about here is uh, the t for the tip off scoring points. Oh, spike rush. This is spike rush hoops. I've never played spike rush hoops. Wow. Oh, I don't know how I'm going to feel about this. I absolutely hate spike rush and rumble. We'll see. Oh, no. Wild. <laughs> the ball just like sticks to your car. 
When you have the spikes, yeah. Fire says, is this a private match? It is, yeah. If yeah, if you'd like to join, um, please join. The it's a custom game. The game is uh, it's just gamer, all lowercase, and no password. Thank you, Emmanuel. Thank you. What is going on? This is wild. Lord Baltimore says, off to my meeting. Good to see you guys. See you soon. Yeah, it was great to uh, great to hear from you. Oh, Alex says, I hit my head on the edge of a cupboard Sunday. Yeah, I've, I've been there a few times. That's not fun. Roxy says, I've been using two of those sites, but the legit people say I don't have enough. Ah, that's unfortunate. Oh, it's about to be crazy, someone. Oh, I just realized we got two more people. All right, good stuff. 3v3 spike rush hoops. This is absolute madness. Oh boy. Oh boy. I am so... Hey! Just kidding. I'm not bad. It's calculated. I was just going to say I'm so bad at uh, spike rush and rumble. Oh, Alex is the next day when I put headphones on it hurt. Yeah, that's not. Uh... I I got a stupid injury while I was out on paternity leave. I uh. uh oh. <laughs> I, I got my stitches out yesterday. I chopped my toe with an axe. What? Yeah. What? Why did you chop your toe with an axe? How did that happen? Uh, I missed the wood, Eric. Why was your foot close enough to be chopped? Because I was using bad form. I was rushing. Man. Oh, man. It, like, glanced off the wood and bounced toward my toe. Ah, uh, okay. So it wasn't, like, a direct, like, you chopped your toe off. No, not off. But I had to have stitches. It was not, it was, uh... <laughs> Calculated! <well>. Yes! <laughs> I was so confused on what to do there. <laughs> Sorry, John, go ahead. I, uh... It was, like, uh... Parallel to the toe, not perpendicular. So it was, uh... Yeah. Okay. So it could, could be worse. Oh, yeah. I didn't, I didn't hit bone. I didn't hit the nail. I just uh, it got her real deep in there. <laughs> Jeez. <laughs> and uh, had to had to go get stitches. I wasn't even gonna get stitches. I sent Cat to the pharmacy to get butterfly bandages and uh, super glue. Oh, super glue! I'm an idiot, Eric. Don't <laughs> don't ever take medical <laughs> advice from me. Um, <laughs> but yeah, sometimes I use super glue on the wounds. <laughs> oh and, man! And, and she came home and she's like, "No, you gotta, you gotta go to urgent care." Yeah. And the people at urgent care is like, "Yeah, your wife was right. You got the meat and potatoes there. <laughs> you got the. This is impressive." <laughs> <laughs> okay, so if anybody, for some reason, the chat is no longer working for me. Um. That's unfortunate. Try to restart it. And also, someone said this is insane. Yeah, this is maybe the most insane seven person, six person now. 3v3 spike rush hoops is madness. I don't hate it, though. I like this a lot more than rumble. Just straight rumble, I mean. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh. Okay, I got ch we got chat back. We got chat back. Um, so I might have missed a few, but the the latest one I saw is Alex said you might as well just put some whiskey with glue in yeah, a broken that's, finger. That's, yeah, that's uh... <laughs> what? <laughs> I 
Sa oh, I, I I have trouble keeping sand around because I just eat it all. <laughs> Love it, someone. Huge defensive play. Huge, huge, huge. Oh, I missed a bounce big time. Let's go! Wow. This is actually madness. Bjorkley says, I don't know if I like it or not. It's certainly crazy. This is different. It's something. This is definitely something. I'm gonna turn... Go. Turn the Master uh, Rocket League volume down. Just a bit. Your John a little bit better. Oh no! Someone left! Oh, Did no. you... Was that intentional, someone? I hope you didn't get kicked. Oh, he said he had to go. Ah, uh, all good. Thanks for... Yeah, thanks for hanging out, someone, and thanks for helping. That, honestly, yeah. that, this was a huge help, dude. Thank you. Thank you so much. Um... And Gamer King says, "Did you see the shot I missed? I I missed it, Gamer King. I'm sorry. I'm trying to uh, I'm trying to wrangle all of this madness right now. There's a lot going on. This, yeah, this is crazy." Oh. Fire RL, I, I love your username so much. Oh no! Oh no! I can't. <laughs> the ball was was had my wheels off the ground, so I couldn't control my car. Yep, yep, yep. Sorry if I spooked you, Fire. I feel like I I feel like I might have spooked you there. Hey, do you remember being scared at work and that was a thing for a little bit? <laughs> yeah, I do. That was really good. Um Alex says, "Text on, congrats." Emmanuel says, "Your party leader, I saw, thank you. Thank you very much." Fire says, "2v2 uh regular what's PM?" But yeah, I'm down to do just 2v2 regular for sure. Alex says, laptop's going to uh, my mom to correct the text. See you later. Yeah, no problem, Alex. Thanks for hanging out. Oh, private. Duh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yes, yes for sure. For sure, 2v2. So here's the issue, though. How do I get you guys into this party? Because... It's just the same code and everything. Oh, no. Here, Yeah, here we go. Here we go. Okay, cool. So, all right, everybody, ready up. Only ways to add. That's so annoying. Fire, have you ever? So you seem like you seem like you know what you're talking about here. Have you ever run into the issue? Oh no, I don't. Uh, I didn't want it to. Be, I didn't want it to be this. Hold on. Ah. Uh, I guess let's just play this one out on this map. Sorry, guys. This is a weird one. I didn't mean to have... Uh, I didn't mean to choose a Rocket Labs one. But, if, yeah, Fire, you've never experienced where it says that, like, your friends list is full, but it's clearly not, and it's, like, not even close? Because I, I, and I do have, so I didn't actually send the uh, the support email, but I have my the EpicGames.com up to send a support email right after the stream to find out what the deal is, because it is infuriating. 
You kind of like it, though. I do not. I, mean, <laughs> I do not. You were telling me between uh, streams one time when we were just chatting that... Oh, that's it? Let's go, Gamer King! Huge! Nice shot! That, uh, that you, you, you kind of liked not having friends. <laughs> yeah, no, uh... Unfortunately, that's one of John's classic uh, straight-up lies that he likes to... <laughs> he likes to tell. Oops. That was my bad. <laughs> I blasted fire. When we are, uh... No, no, sabotage. Yeah. <laughs> I'm terrible. You are fine. Yeah, but I'm not good at this game. <laughs> I mean, it takes many, 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 many hundreds of hours to be good at this game. So... Don't sweat it. Oh, look, oh, look at this! Look, look at, at this! That. Ah! Nice shot, Gamer King. Huge. Pants. Oh. Yeah, sorry about this arena, guys. I'll I'll actually pick a real one for the next one. That is my bad. I missed. I missed the ball. <laughs> Fire says, "R.I.P. My flip reset." <laughs> I mean, at least. You can you can even get close to flip resets. I'm nowhere near that level yet. Uh, I, I, maybe I'm near that level, but I'm not at that level yet. What rank are you, Fire? The at next stop. Wow, Gamer King's going off. Let's go. Yeah, I know. Gamer King said he was silver. Hey, Eric. Yes. Are you? A player of Animal Crossing at all? I am not. It's uh, absolutely nothing against it, and I know I would love that game. But those kinds of games where it's like the point is to burn time, uh. it like I feel like I can't add another one of those to my life ever. Because I, like, I already have just a handful. Like, Minecraft is my main game that if I just want to burn time, I just go into Minecraft. <laughs> um, but, uh, but, but why do you ask? Have you been loving it? I've been playing it, yes. My, my son, who you know. I do. Has been playing it, and, uh, he got it for me for Christmas. So I could like play with him. Oh, <laughs> nice! And like, and like go to his island and stuff. Yeah, and it's, it, it's it's so much fun. Yeah, that's it's, the best. It's awesome. And like he he like builds me stuff and like gives me fossils that his museum can't take and. <laughs> that's the best. I, I help him read stuff and help him like build stuff. And it's really cool. We make fun of the neighbors. We do weird stuff. <laughs> yeah, no, I'm I'm so sure I would love that game, but oh man. But yeah, I feel like every once in a while I get it into my head that like I want to start a new that kind of game, and like I tried. Uh... Oh god, what is it? It's like a really popular. It's like a farming simulator. Oh, the, uh, something do something. Stardew, Stardew Valley? Yeah. Maybe? It, yeah, I, th I think it probably was Stardew Valley, the one I tried. And, and like, I loved it, as I do with every single one of those games. But I just have a weird time. Like, if there's no object, my brain is just like, why are you doing this? 
Like you could be you could be doing you could be working towards something. I don't know. It's just a weird. I don't know. Yeah, uh, Animal Crossing's really good at like trickling out um, like features, like like pieces of the game you can unlock. Things. Yeah. New things you can do, and new objectives, and new like ways to play like as you advance. It's it's really cool. Yeah, I'm uh I mean I think part of the reason I'm hesitant to try it is because I know I would just be I would put too much time into it that I absolutely do not have. <laughs> I fire says hate this man yeah same fire. I'm really sorry. That was my bad. I did not mean I mean who would have thought that it would have picked this map out of random? But, uh, but no, John, I've been playing, uh, Assassin's Creed Valhalla, and I am now... Oh, my God. I just, like, I, I, I'm i loving it, but I'm now 70 hours in, and I was oh ready God. to be done 20 hours ago. And I'm yeah. just, like, I just am, I just want to finish it, and every time I, f I think I'm, like, close to the end... I'm not at all, and it's driving me crazy. Uh, oh man, I was thinking about picking that one up next. It's it is good. It is super good. But I don't know that I want to put that much time into it. Yeah, I mean, yeah, it's it's a lot. Like if uh, but, it, if there's a if a game has an end to it, I need to like come to yeah, that end in yeah. a decent amount of time now. Um, Unless it's unless it's an Elder Scrolls game, yeah. Then I, then I I'm, I'm happy for it to go on forever. But if it's, yeah. Have you if it's played? Take, go ahead. If it's gonna take like eighty hours, I, I'll never finish it, and I will just feel unfulfilled. Uh, have you played Breath of the Wild yet? No, I have not. If you are even remotely considering Assassin's Creed Valhalla. Don't get Assassin's Creed Valhalla and get Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild. Because Breath of the Got Wild it. is Assassin's Creed Valhalla, but 20 times better. And uh, and it's just like a better, like a more interesting world. It's just better in every way. Uh, but it's essentially the same kind of game. Alright. That, um, is, that is wonderful uh, advice there. And I will take that advice. Yeah. Yeah, to I mean, Breath of the Wild is, is tr truly a masterpiece. Valhalla is very good, but it's not a masterpiece. Um, yeah, Breath of the Wild is... Whew, yeah, that game is something else. Alright, we will... Urban Central Night. I like this one. I'm, uh... Slowly working my way through the story mode of uh, Call of Duty Cold War right now. Yeah, I haven't played the story. I've been playing a ton of multiplayer of that game, but I haven't played the story mode yet. Hey, is it? Hey, are you liking it? Pretty good. Nice. Yeah, I'm super pumped to uh to play the campaign of that game. I've I, I've been loving the multiplayer. I like this Call of Duty multiplayer more than I've liked a Call of Duty multiplayer since probably Black Ops One. So it's like ten years. Oh, nice. Cool. Yeah, I mean, I, and and I and it it's very much because I'm actually good at this one, and I'm usually not good at Call right. of Duty games at all. But this one feels a lot like the old school Call of Duty games. Oh boy. Yeah. Oh boy. Like I. Oh boy. Oh. oh man. Oh. I yeah, I was I was really good at like Call of Duty when it was like World War Two, and and then I was I was awesome at Black Ops. Yep, same. And then, and then after that, I was terrible. Same. <laughs> I, I, sort of, I sort of fell out of love with it with the online multiplayer, but same for sure. Ju but, um, but I always I always play through the story mode before I jump into the multiplayer. So yeah, know. dude, let's uh. Let me know if you ever want to either run multiplayer or run zombies, because I I'm 99% sure uh, duty's cross-platform. Really? In fact, I know it's cross-platform, now that I think That's about awesome. it, yeah. 
Yeah, so let me know. The zombies mode in this one I think is very good. Are they Nazi zombies? Uh, yeah, I think they're always pretty much Nazi zombies. Nice. That makes it more satisfying to kill them. Yeah, but uh, <laughs> yeah, for sure, for sure. Um, but this uh, this map is essentially the same map from uh, yeah. World at War, just like expanded, which I which I like a lot. Oh, nice. Gamer King says, "Sorry, I stole your goal." You're all good, Gamer King. Um, let's do for the next game. Let's change up the teams here. Let's get me and John on a team, and let's get Gamer King and Fire on a team. So I feel like we've been the same teams for almost the whole stream. Also, Gamer King says, "I'm a silver, but I don't know. I just play like I'm not." Yeah, you definitely don't play like a silver gamer king. That's for sure. Oh, I missed. This little bump there. Uh oh, <laughs> that's my bad. Nice. I should I should have just scored that. <sighs> Sometimes I get too uh, trigger happy with the camera. And I do. Uh oh, here we go. Here we go. Fire's going for some big goals. Highlight reel only. <clears throat> wow! <laughs> I'm sorry if I messed you up there, Gamer King. I feel like I can't. You were ready, and I kind of came down on top of you. My bad. Bjorkley says I'm starting to like that game a lot. You you mean this game, Bjorkley? Rocket League? This game is extremely fun, extremely addicting. It's one of those games that's like easy to understand, but ridiculously hard to master. Shot there, like that. Yeah, it was a laser. Ah. So John, have you? Uh, what's the craziest news that has come out of CES so far? Um, well, I mean, the, the GM stuff is is pretty cool. They gave us a little more. They teased the Cadillac Celestic a little bit more. And, is that uh, is that how you pronounce it? In my mind, I was saying it Celestique, but yeah, I think it's Celestic. Okay. Um. Ooh, <laughs> I, I dislike it a lot more now. <laughs> <laughs> but, I mean, I've, I've seen that car in person already, and it's, it's beautiful. Nice. I, I can't wait for them to, like, completely show it off. But it does, does some wild stuff. Um, like, the, the roof, the glass roof is... Um, 
you know, like a, it's like four quadrants that each passenger can choose their own level of transparency, which is kind of wild. Wow, yeah, that's really cool. This and is a real, this is a production vehicle? This is not like a concept car? This is, um, yeah, produ production intent. I mean, it's a prototype. I got you, sure, gotcha. But it's um, not like a, it's not like a vision concept or anything. No, 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 no. Okay. Um, yeah, this is a, a yeah, production intent. It's, um, it's basically going to be Cadillac's new, like, Halo car. It's, uh, wow. you know, going to be, like, sort of hand-built uh, with lots of customization for customers. Um, yeah, it's beautiful. It's this big sedan everything lights up <laughs> like everything's a screen. i love you know i love that yeah <laughs> um so for this game let's do uh john let's let's do me and you and then we'll uh okay. so you join sunless con team because i rep my boy sunless okay and, uh, he's not my boy i've never met him i i wish we were boys though seems like a cool guy Fire says, what's your rank? I think I, uh, I don't know. Diamond 1 or Diamond 2 currently. What's yours, Fire? Um, and then Gamer King says, you had lots of shots. I messed some up. All good, Gamer King. I, tr trust me, I mess up shots literally all the time. <laughs> Nonstop. That's all I know how to do. Moose Guy. What's up, Moose Guy? <laughs> Moose Guy says, bruh, Joe just shouted you out. Who is Joe? I don't know who Joe is. President elect? Uh oh. <laughs> Let's stay away from all from all politics talk. <laughs> <laughs> Um, if, if Joe Biden's given shout outs though, that's pretty cool. Yeah, I mean, yeah, that would be... Oh, nice shot. Oh! Moose guy yeah. got me. Moose guy got me. I'm not even mad. That's actually funny. Joe Mama. <laughs> Your, your mom's not in the stream today. She is. She. she well, she was earlier. I didn't. I didn't. I haven't seen her. Well, I've been watching the chat as much as usual. <laughs> Moose guy says I was bored. You got a sub though. Hey, thank you. And and that was at least one that was actually funny. And two, it wasn't like annoying or ridiculously profane. That's a good one. I like. I yeah, like that joke. Yeah. <laughs> It was it was pretty well executed. <laughs> yeah, it was very well executed. <laughs> but yeah, no, pre appreciate the uh, the subscribe a lot. Thank you. Also, if anybody has no clue what Autoblog is or what we do, um, we so gaming oh. is an extremely small part of what we do. But uh, one of our producers just put together an absolutely fire sizzle reel. That is uh, on our YouTube, um, what I guess like homepage, I guess. But if you're interested in learning more about what we do, just go check out that sizzle reel. Uh, John, John, John! Oh, <laughs> sorry, sorry, I was uh, I'm, I'm grabbing that thing and dropping it in the chat. Oh, awesome! Me. Thank you. And, and, and responding to a Slack from. Uh, Editor in chief, great. No, that's, and, that is perfect. Important, important stuff. All good. Great building. CES. Oh, gave us a freebie. Okay, got it right back. Where the heck is that? Um, Gamer King says, "Sorry, I'm back. I'm modding a channel and watching and playing here, so I'm hopping back and forth. <laughs> no problem." Moose guy says, "All right, I gotta go now. See ya." No problem, Moose guy. Thanks for uh, thanks for popping by and thanks for the sub. Um, oh, that was lucky. Bjorkley, right. looks like Bjorkley is, is leaving. No problem, Bjorkley. Thanks for hanging out. I still, I love your name. It's a great name. I dropped, I dropped the, 
the highlight reel. Oh, beautiful. Into, Thank you. Into the uh, Twitch chat. Oh, wait. I'm going the wrong way. Sorry, Eric. No, you're all good. It's hard to tell when everything gets shaded gray. Yeah, it is. Oh, <laughs> DJZ. Thank you for the follow, DJ. Gamer King says, what do you think I play like? I assume you mean rank. Ah, that's my bad. I assume you mean rank. I don't know. I'm so bad. I'm so bad at guessing ranks. And I'm even worse now after the free-to-play reboot because all the ranks got, like, reset and messed up. So, at least the lower ones did. I assume the higher ones did, too, but I just don't. I'm not at that level, so I don't know. Um, oh, oh, I love that. Hey, feels, feels all right. Uh, but Gamer King, I would say you play like a, like a high gold, I would say. Either high gold or low plat. Fire, I'm going to say... Hmm. I'm going to say your current rank is D3, Diamond 3. I'd believe I'd believe champ though. I I, I believe champ, because you you've got the aerials for sure. Oh, I thought I had you. I thought I had you. <clears throat> hey, I nailed it. D3C1. <laughs> I love it. Uh, DJ says, um, is your day going good? Yeah, it's not too bad today. Oh, and Moose of Milk. Thank you for the follow, Moose. But, uh, but yeah, how, how's your, how's your day going, DJ? Just, uh, just playing some laid back Rocket League here. By the way, guys, for anybody who has seen some of our previous Rocket League streams, this is the first Rocket League stream on the PC. I hope it looks much better. It sure looks much better on my end. Um. But yeah, I feel like this has got to be our best looking Rocket League stream thanks to this uh, shiny new PC. Except you can't see your dog. That's true. That's true. No more dog cam. But we'll, uh... Oh, wow. Nice, nice move. Um, I'll call her up here before we, before we end the stream. Alex is back from mobile. What's up, Alex? Oh, my fault, John. No, that was me. That was my my fault. Nope, you're good. Nope. Wow. Oh, I'm not good. <laughs> stupid. <laughs> oh no, I, it's too much. Too much. That was my bad. That should have been a goal. <laughs> I just see. I'm only, uh... Oh, okay. Interesting. Yeah, fire... Fire's, uh... <laughs> <laughs> DJ says, I'm gold one. Nice. I Yeah, I think gold is, is... At least for me, gold was where I really started to... Like, understand the game a lot more. Was was in the gold ranks, I feel like. Um... Wow. Oh. oh, I should have tried to keep it up more. Unfortunate. Um, and Alex says, I love your boost. It looks really cool. Thank you. Yeah, in fact, this is a, um, I got this one in the store because I thought it looked so cool. I think it's, uh, it's painted purple candy floss, I believe.
painted purple candy floss. Yeah, Rally Bob says, "Hey, are you in colorblind mode?" Mm. You know, I did mess around with colorblind mode in the past. I don't think I am currently. Let's see. No, I don't think I'm on colorblind mode. But but I I'm I think I know what you're referring to. Um I think you're referring to the the like the names looking different. And I think there there is a setting for that. Oh, nice nice save. Wow, nice save again. <laughs> Alex says, you may not believe me, but I don't really like candies. I believe that. I'm not... Re I never used to be... Um, I like it... I like them more now, but when I was younger, I never used to really be into, like, sweets. And, uh... And, and even now, I, I think I prefer, like, like salty or, or savory uh, tastes to, to sweet tastes. I have to be in a certain kind of mood. Um, or it's just got to be really good sweets. My, my my mom makes these crazy like peanut butter uh, like peanut butter ball things that are like delicious, and I could eat those all day. But that's like a rare exception. Buck guys, what's that? You talking about buck guys? I don't know. What's a what's in a buck guy? It's like a peanut butter ball with like chocolate on the outside. No, no, no chocolate in this one. Oh. Um. I think it's like it's like peanut butter and like Rice Krispies, kinda. Um, it's good. It's super good. Um, Jaden, what's up, Jaden? Welcome. Hello. Um, but yeah, I'm not. I, I'm sorry, I didn't confirm. I'm 99% sure we're not in colorblind mode, Rally Bob. But, I, but there is a, a setting. There is a certain setting, I feel like. Uh, yeah, here we go. Nameplate scale. Nameplate mode default. Huh? Yeah, I'm not sure. No, but why is it all, like, black and white instead of, like, orange and... Oh! Oh, that's just because, um... So, like, in, in tournaments, and if you're, like, on a team, it will default to whatever color... You can choose the color of your team. That's kind of a... It's not really newish anymore, but it's it's newish, like, in the past year or so that you can do that. But, yeah, orange and, and blue are just the defaults. Gotcha. Oh. oh, nice steel fire. I thought I had you. Thought I had you. Uh, nice Whoa. shot, Gamer King. Dang, I'm not even mad. That was a real nice shot. Yes, colorblind is off. I'm trying to... Uh... <laughs> oh man. Wow. <laughs> That's my bad. Yeah. <laughs> yep, I did I did see that that was off officially. Um but I'm just trying to figure out if I have anything else necessarily uh special, but I but I don't think I do. Oh, nice pass, John. Sorry I wasn't there for it. That wasn't a pass. It was trying to be a shot, but... Nice pass, John. That was calculated. <laughs> <laughs> if, if, it, if it works out a certain way, even if it's not the way you intended, it's always still calculated. That is the rule. <gasps> Whoa! Like that! What was that? He just got that sent. Like... Uh, <laughs> I launched you. <laughs> <laughs> that was oh, cool. Oh, man. 
That was wild. <laughs> yep, <laughs> yep, Tommy M says never admit to the bad shot. That was a good pass. <laughs> exactly, <laughs> exactly. Alex had a nice shot. Yeah, it's. I will say this. It, it may have been a shot, but I had it as a, my backup plan. If it didn't go <laughs> there in, we go. Was it, was it was to be a pass. Yes. There we go. It was, it was just a shot placed, uh, you know, <laughs> with an opportunity. Exactly. Exactly. Oh, that. Tommy M says, "Quit while you're behind." Now, now we're win we're winning this for sure. Oh my bad, I I that was unintentional. Why are you apologizing for pulling him up? I I just feel like I, I don't know. I feel like in private matches, it, it can sometimes be seen as like what the kids call sweaty. <laughs> if you've ever heard that term, it's like, why are you trying so hard? It's just a private match. You don't need to be blowing people up. So, so I've, I've been trying to do it less in, in private matches. In real matches, I blow people up all day. It is demo town in every single one of my games. But. You're a weird dude. Me? Yes. True. Uh, Alex is leaving. I'll see you later, Alex. Thanks for hanging out. Goodbye. Oh, I'm so bad. I'm so bad at Rocket League. Oh. Hey! I love that move. <laughs> you gotta you, sometimes you gotta play the man, not the puck. True. Know? True. Oh, terrible face off by me. Fire gave us a freebie again. <laughs> <laughs> nice goal, Eric. <laughs> it's calculated. Tournament winner. Autoblog Eric, tournament winner. Oh, yeah. Yeah, that's the other nice thing about being on PC now, is I can actually have my name say Autoblog. It actually it makes halfway sense now. That is a huge development. Oh. Uh, unhappy baby. Uh oh. Alright, OT. I am guessing that that baby would like a fresh diaper and some milk <laughs> if i know ba if i know babies true I, I i don't even know babies and that's that'd be my guess too <laughs> nice. look at that look at you go oh yeah sort of dribbling it in What's up, Tim? My dog Tim just rolled in. Oh. AKA Chimmy. AKA. Idiot oh. Face.
Chimmy is a great dog. And yes, we'll, let's do one with unlimited boost. Fire. I'm setting it up right now. Ooh, just boosting all over. Yeah. Yeah, Chimmy's a so good the, boy. This is going to be the game where Fire absolutely smokes everyone, I, I'm going to assume. Um, boost amount unlimited. Ah. Uh. Fire says yes, correct. So fire is fire's planning on uh, flexing a little bit. But that's fine. Flex to your heart's content. Oh. 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 First blood. Yes, yeah. sir. What do you? You're like a sidewinder. Oh yeah. <laughs> Boosting everywhere. Never let up the boost. Yep. There should be a there should be a rule that you have to boost. 100% of the time. I, yeah, I, I've never played a game like that, but sometimes in training, I'll just, like, try, just to, like, I feel like it's a good way to train. I just, like, never let off the boost, and that is difficult. Nice. That's cool there. I, I'm, I'm just boosting 100% of the time. That's my goal. I love it. It's a good goal. My, that's my secondary goal. My main goal is, is to blow, blow up. up and act like <laughs> I don't know nobody. <laughs> <laughs> oh man, what a great reference! Man, was that Vine? Was that <laughs> probably? Whatever <laughs> happened to that guy, Riff Raff? He is still around doing his thing. That is like he's yeah. like the weirdest dude. But somebody, <laughs> either he's rich from what he does, or someone is financing him. Oh, I'm so bad. But yeah, he lives quite the life. At least it seems that way. Uh. Pachu, hello. Welcome. I'm not sure what you just said in the chat, but but welcome. Boost, boosting everywhere. That controller's just vibrating out of control. <laughs> <laughs> Love that move. Oh, thought I had it. I like that fire is also a calculated guy. I too am a uh, guy or gal. I'm not, I guess I'm not sure, but a uh, calculated person. I, I too love to drop the calculateds. Fire says guy. Alright. Uh Basti's here. What's up, Basti? How you been? I 
Oh. Sorry. You're good. I'm boosting. Never not boosting. <laughs> not boosting. The vibration of the controllers make my hand feel weird, though. I mean, <laughs> my, I'm pretty sure you can change the setting to make the vibration lower if it's uh, if it's driving you crazy in settings. And we are we are up by one right now, so if you want to do that, now will be the time. Nope. Okay. Oh no. Basti says, been pretty good. How about you? Not too bad. Just uh, streaming some Rocket League on the on the new PC. I'm a pretty happy with the performance so far. Oh, nice shot! Got a boost. That's huge. I accidentally let go of the button for a second there. Gamer King says, this is my last match and I'm gonna go. No problem, Gamer King. Thanks for uh thanks for hanging out. Oh, look at this. Yeah, thanks for thanks for hanging out and watching today. As always. Nice shot. Thought I had it. Wow, look at that pass! Boosting 100% of the time, I could have maybe had that, but <laughs> that was the rules. That's true. Fire says I'm goaded. Uh oh, you're gonna have to win this game before you can say that. And he immediately scores and just smiles. <laughs> <laughs> oh no! I did, I went for boost off the rip. We have unlimited boost. So dumb. Win for Musty. Wow. Indeed. So I think Gamer King is um is out. Uh Fire, is there there's no way you can join my party here? Or is there a way that I can join yours? Wait a minute, let's try this. I 
I wish you could just add the party. Why do you have to add as a friend? Yeah. It's, uh... The worst. Because if Gamer King's out, I'd love to just do... We'll just do, like, some casual threes. If you're if yeah. you're still down, Fire. And if you're down, John. Yeah, I'm... Always. Okay, so it looks like... It looks like... F I don't... I... Man, I wish I understood. Why... Why can some people add me and some people can't? I do not... Did it give you any trouble at all, Fire? Or did it just let you add? Alright, so we all leave right, in this so, match? Yeah, yeah, so let's leave this match and we'll hop in a, uh, we'll hop in a casual game. Sounds good. Here we go. Uh oh. Car. Oh wow. Oh, we got the Fennec crew. <laughs> no boost in a dream. <laughs> Okay, I need to remember that it's not I'm gonna boost anymore. Yes, yes. <laughs> <laughs> it was fun while it lasted. Following, following you too close to to get that rebound. Oh, you're good. I thought I was trying to show off a little bit there. Wow, nice shot. Yes. Huge. I almost forgot to join my Grand Arena in uh, Galaxy of Heroes. Oh, is I... If it just ended, then I forgot. Whoops. No, no I got an, uh, an hour left. Okay, good, good. Hour and a half left. Good, good, good. I'll do it right after the stream. My fault. I got Grief Cargo up to seven stars today. Oh, love it! My oh, man. I've been, uh... My man was a favorite... My favorite line from, uh... From probably the whole series so far. What? Wow, what's the li Is it a spoiler line, or...? Yeah. No, it's from season one. When he says, He's trying to eat me! <laughs> yeah, that favorite. is a good one. <laughs> That's the best. <laughs> uh, just think about it, it cracks me up. 
I saw a video today of a, of a woman trying virtual reality for the first time, and she's like, and like she's like up in the air, like and like look down, and she's like floating, and she's like, oh wow, and so she like like jumps into the wall, like dives into the wall, like forgetting that it's not real. Oh and man, she can't actually she can't actually fly. Dude, I feel like so. It is crazy how fast virtual reality tricks your brain. Let's go! Nice. Oh, shot. Uh, Basti says, "What happened to your audio?" Ah, Basti, I don't know if it's me, but I think you sounded better the last time. Yes, Basti, it's because we changed up the whole stream. Um, I'm streaming from my PC now, and I'm using my headset mic to pick up the audio. So yeah, it's not quite as clear. Um, we might bring the the official, the official, the original mic back into it, but it's just such a it's such a pain. I cannot describe what a pain it is, um, and this it just works. Don't do it. So. So we might stick with this uh, for a little while. I like Please. I like this sound. I like it's like uh, something comforting about it. Like so having, uh, can we, wait, go ahead. <laughs> it's like having like your homeboy in your ear while you're on a mission. Yeah. Like... So uh, yeah. So it's like um, this is a wireless headset, and I've had people describe it to me as like it sounds like I'm on a cell phone. Kinda. And it uh, sounds like you're, uh, you're, like, have you ever spoken to someone on like an airplane, like, you know, the like on an airplane, <laughs> like the like the headsets that pilots use. I I can't say I have. <laughs> well, it's like that. It okay. Like that to me. All right. Basti says, oh, okay, feels bad. Is it that much worse, Basti? Is it really, like, that much worse? Oh. Not worrying. This is, this is comeback time. I know you're not a tofu guy, but boy, we found this recipe that is, it's, it's easy, it's easy as heck, but oh my god, it's just phenomenal. What, is, so just, like what does a tofu recipe entail? Like are you making the actual tofu? No, 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 like the, res the recipe is tofu Great and... Pass. It's tofu and asparagus in like this uh, black pepper sauce. Oh, okay. Oh my god, it's incredible. Absolutely incredible. I can't stop thinking about it. There's, there's been that. Our, our friend uh, gave us her recipe after we had the baby. Our friend dried off, dropped off some uh, fried burritos. Oh. And uh, gave us the recipe for them, and uh, you know we made a bunch, and then like you know froze them, just nice. reheat them in the oven. And, and, I yeah, thought so. that was wide. I'm so sorry. I would have tried. Wow! Can you hear? Shot. Can you hear the baby? No. No. Okay. Cool. Then I won't. Then I won't shake it. <laughs> my 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 friend is in a band called Shake Your Baby. 
<laughs> That's great. What kind of music? Punk. Nice. Yeah, of course. But I don't even know what I what other kind of band would be named Shake Your Baby. Of course, it was a punk band. <laughs> I've been listening a lot to uh, the band Polyphia. Ooh, I haven't heard of them. So they... So the way I describe... Their guitar player is Tim Henson. And the way I... The Muppets guy? No, 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 no. <laughs> this is like a, like a kid, like a young kid. And I never would say he's... Um, oh, B Bando wants to know if anyone in chat is selling Fennec. We actually had somebody earlier looking for a Fennec, and we didn't hear, we didn't see anything, unfortunately, Bando. And then Fire says, we were getting farmed. Yeah, maybe, but it's all right. We'll beat him this time. Um, but no, so the, so Tim Henson is like a young kid. The way I describe him is he's. it would be ridiculous to call him or anyone the best guitar player alive. But he probably is the most unique guitar player alive. Like, I have never heard anybody play guitar like the way Tim Henson plays guitar. Until I heard Tim Henson play guitar. And he just has such a unique style. And it's just so unlike anything I've ever heard. And his band, Polyphia, I guess it's like... I guess some people might call them math rock, but like I absolutely okay. hate that term because yeah, it's yeah. it's really it's just outrageously precise guitar, and like it's very inspired by it's like clearly very inspired like by like hip hop. Um, okay. Man, I just can't I can't get enough of it. Like these guys are so ridiculously good, particularly Tim Henson. I do not understand how you write the things this kid writes. Like at all. I can't even rap I mean, I've been playing guitar and I'm not great at guitar, but I've been playing guitar for like 15 years and I can't even wrap my head around how you would write something like this. Like I don't get please, it, but it is. Will you send me a link after this? Too? Yes, yes, I will. Yes, I will. And I don't even know what made me think of it, but I guess just because the one of their songs is stuck in my head. And man, it is it is good. I've been listening to that new Jack Harlow album. Yeah, yeah. Um, been like trying to listen to any like. Audrey Nuna stuff that comes out. I wish she would like come out with like a full album. Um, Have you heard? So this is like a newer. She her one song's been getting. Her name's Rosie. Okay. No. She's like very new. She's had just one song that's blowing up. I think off a of TikTok. And. uh really good too well at least that one song is i that's the only song i've heard by her but uh i'm trying to think of the name of the song i cannot think of it what are, what are some good songs by you said audrey audrey nuna i i sent you a couple links it sounds so that, familiar she has that one song with with jack harlow which is yep like yep 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 yep, yep yep yes yes i know exactly what you're talking about now yeah yeah she's insane so this rosie's a, awesome, a way man. different genre She's she's like Audrey's like hype. That's <laughs> it's like super hype. Rosie's not hype at all. She's like chilled out pop music. <gasps> and Audrey Newton is gonna blow up. Yes, one billion percent. She's she's, she's crazy. Yeah. I've been. I've been listening to a lot of uh, <laughs> that Sean Wasabi album over and over. And yep, yep. Of Wally. Wally keeps requesting it. Ah, that's awesome. Yeah, that guy. That guy's amazing. Yeah, I, I love that. Uh, that style of production a lot. Super talented. Yeah.
Oh, I wish I had boost. <laughs> Yeah, Wally, at bedtime, he's been asking what a for that. He's been asking for that song, uh. Uh, Peeve Shalpatine. <laughs> by, uh. Yeah. You know that emo song? By, uh, yeah, yeah. Canadian softball. Or yes, yes. <laughs> he's been asking for that, and followed by the whole Sean Masabi Mango Tail album. Fall asleep, too. Nice. Yeah, sure. Yeah, Sean Wasabi would be great falling asleep music. It is. Beef Shelf. That's so funny. Have you heard any of that? So, uh, the the main guy behind that band, his name's Jared Alonji. Are you aware okay. of this guy? He has several like parody bands, and okay. they're all really fun. So, like that Canadian softball is a parody of modern baseball. And okay. he has, which if you've never heard, is a is a, I mean they're a good bit. Like I like their music, and I assume that Jared Alonji does too. That's why he he parodies it. But um yeah, but he has like a, like heavy heavy metal parodies. He has um he has a pop punk parody band called uh oh my god what are they called. Sunrise Skater Kids. Sunrise Skater Kids okay. is the name of the pop punk, and all of like all of it is so good and so funny. And I would highly recommend uh, would highly recommend all of it if you were into Sheev Pal or Peeve Shelpatine. <laughs> <laughs> Man, that, that's so. I mean, that song's so funny to me. <laughs> I know. It's good though. It's. It's like really well executed. That's the thing. Like all of his, he's clearly so talented, but just all he does, he's like a, he's like the weird owl for like the scene. Sure. sure, sure. <laughs> yeah, that guy got his start on YouTube making just comedy videos of if you've ever seen the video of like every pop punk vocalist and it's just him in his garage like with the mic nice. just just making fun of all this stupid stuff pop punk vocalists say like man i absolutely love pizza i love my friends <laughs> <laughs> Melody it. You guys are all my friends. Let's go get some pizza. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you for the follow. Who? Oh God, I can't make out the name. I will catch it after uh, we lose this game by a lot. <laughs> Yikes. <laughs> uh. Will. Assume that's pronounced Will. But thank you for the follow. It's much appreciated. Dang. Brutal. Yeah, that is brutal. All right, let's uh let's back out of these guys and we'll find a new <laughs> we'll find a new uh new people to play here. Inspect. Inspect 99 times 2. So I believe that's 1 98? Yes. Wow! Good, Matt. go me. I'm v I'm extremely proud of myself for that. Uh. <laughs> but, but, uh, welcome, Inspect. Welcome. We're just about. Will, Will Walter says, wow, you got clapped. Yeah, we did. We did. Yeah, that was bad. Did. That was tough. We're playing against the professor. Also, welcome, Will. But yeah, we're just about finished with the stream. We do this every Tuesday and Thursday from 2 o'clock to 4 o'clock Eastern Time. And it is uh, 3.46, so we got one or two games left. And we will be calling it a stream, but we will be back Thursday. 
with uh we're gonna be playing some dirt rally 2 on thursday i'm super pumped for that i gave dirt 5 another chance on pc and uh unfortunately it, it oh unfortunately it wasn't much better on pc than uh than it was on console so uh so we're, i think we're gonna go to the tried and true dirt rally 2.0 i i love dirt rally 2.0 and that'll be some fun on Thursday. Oh, wow. Um, a, I'm not sure. I apologize. I'm not sure if I'm pronouncing your name right. But a Selder says you are currently. Duh! I'm so bad. <laughs> oh, what a terrible look. For we are currently the most viewed American speaking streamer for Rocket League, and I just made a play like that. So, thanks for letting us know. That's crazy. That's awesome. I'm super thanks, happy thanks. about that. But, uh, and thank you for the follow, Sorry. Zachary. Thank Stole you for your follow. boost. Nope, nope, you're good. I'm, I'm playing like a ding dong right now. Ah, and thank you for the follow. Um, Oh, it's a Selder. Just ahead of Corrupted G. Oh no! Oh no! <laughs> oh my god! What am I oh, doing? No. I am the worst. I'm the worst. Yeah, 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 I am. I All got right, to talk yeah. about car batteries today with, a, with an actual car battery like, guy. Oh, yeah. yeah. That's always exciting to me. What's uh, any any exciting insights come from that uh, conversation? Um. Nothing groundbreaking, just got sort of a better sense of uh, what's coming down the road. It's kind of crazy. G GM is is um, launching uh, its next-gen... How did I miss that? Its next-gen uh, EV batteries, the Ultium. Yep, called. yep. And... Um, <laughs> And they're, they've already got, like, another generation coming after that. So, oh, wow. So, so the, yeah, they're flying. How fast do you think they're going to come up with an excuse to fix their awful new logo? <laughs> <laughs> I give it a year. It's so bad, dude. I could not believe it was real when I saw it. Yeah. Oh, yeah. man. Yeah, I don't know. I don't mind it too much, but... Yeah, I, I am. Uh, I am not a fan. <laughs> someone, someone, uh, I'm friends with on Facebook, who's um, used to be in the uh, marketing side of uh, the automotive business, um, likened it to like, or, like, did the person who, and this is sort of a deep cut. You may not remember this at all. Did the person yeah. who came up with the Chevy Volt. Uh, song and dance come up with this logo there was when the Chevy Volt first came out in like I don't know 2009 yeah and it was uh, a, oh no I'm thinking of the Chevrolet Beat never mind <laughs> never mind uh, so there was at the LA Auto Show they, there was a song and dance for it and it was just Cringe Toby. Dude, what is with these people? They're so cringy. It was. I, I, I'll send you. I'll send it to you. It's like. Oh man, it was just the best. It's like. <laughs> Dude, I just remember one of the er, one of our earliest rocket rocket league. One of our earliest uh, auto vlog videos is from an old auto show. And it was a uh, the press conference for the Chevrolet Beat, 
and it's just this guy with the most over-the-top voice, like, INTRODUCING THE CHEVROLET BEAT! And there's just people <laughs> doing backflips across the stage. It's like, no one is this hyped about this car! No one! Like, it doesn't have to be this hype! You can be excited about it, but you don't have to hire, like, trapeze artists. I just don't... Just too much. I think they just do a little too much. Remember a couple years ago, Lexus had that uh, that press conference, and the at the end, like he like he was building up this whole like moment, and the moment was him saying, "So we've got some pow, and we've got yes! some wow." Yes. And he stands there, no one's like reacting at all. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, <laughs> I like, can't he looks imagine. So happy, and then he's just completely crestfallen when no one reacts. Oh my god! <laughs> it's like people write that stuff, and they're like. This is going to absolutely kill. People are going to love this. Like, <sighs> I don't get it, dude. I'm expecting people like get to their feet and start screaming or something. But it's <laughs> like, so good. Oh, man. There, there's some, man, I've seen some weird, weird press conferences. <laughs> yeah, it's just so... Go ahead, go ahead. There is one from uh, 2009, 2010, maybe, Detroit Auto Show. Um, BYD, uh, a Chinese automaker called uh, BYD stands for Build Your Dreams, which is pretty hilarious already. <laughs> this just really weird video that they played during their presentation. And, like, and it really badly, tra like, the narration was like, it was very clearly an English speaker, like a native English speaker reading it, but reading the very badly translated yeah. English. And it, oh. was, it was really funny. And there was like there was like weird imagery, there was like goose stepping Nazis and stuff. Oh <laughs> like, my god. Like, they were like going through the history of cars and I don't know how they tied Nazis into it. Yeah, but that's uh <laughs> it was Oh man! If if oh. and, and, it, and one line was my favorite. It was, it was talking about how like uh, trains suddenly became popular. It said, "Just in one night, steamers took over the earth." <laughs> <laughs> steamers. <laughs> oh, <laughs> yeah. I think the uh, so I th I think that's gonna be the last game fire. Just cause we're we gotta. Mm. Yeah, yeah, we gotta wrap up because we usually we usually end at four, um, because that's gonna be the last game. But yeah, the last thing I wanted to say about that was, um, oh, thank you for the uh, thank you for the follow, Sage. Was I, I just feel like it's just the for a lot of these companies, it's just a classic case of like they're too like they're too far in the forest to see the trees. And it's yes. just like they expect everyone to be so hyped about, quite frankly, idiotic things that no one in the world cares about but them. But but like they have to care about and they should care about and that's great. Like it's super good that they care about like the littlest things, but the vast, vast majority of people I feel like just don't. And mm -hmm. and I feel like their excitement just doesn't translate and i feel like maybe <laughs> maybe some people understand that and they try to uh they try to overcompensate with just pure enthusiasm and i feel like that's the wrong move <laughs> but yeah. maybe that's misreading the uh the marketing situation at, at some of these companies but and i'm not even I saying so. any specific company just in general right not even auto com i think tech companies do this all the time Right, right. Absolutely, seen, nobody I've cares. Seen some about really them. good. I've seen some really good and like relevant and like, you know, uh, <laughs> like on on brand sort of like concise uh, press conferences lately too. Yeah. Uh, uh, the GM one today was was good. Um, good. Uh, Audi, uh, well, now he's Volkswagen, Volkswagen of America. He was, he was Audi of America, uh, boss. Um, what's his name? 
Scott Kia always has really, really good um, presentations that are like, you know, directly like what you want to hear, you know? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> and how you want to hear it. It's realistic. It's, you know, relatable and gets the stuff across. It's not like, we got some pow. Yeah. That's a why. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. It's just, I, I really think, I think Steve Jobs ruined the keynote speech for like a generation because everybody <laughs> wants to, everybody wants to be Steve Jobs now. And it's like, yeah. I promise if anybody's watching this and you think you're Steve Jobs, you're not, you're never going to be, don't try to be, you look ridiculous. Uh, a hundred percent of the time. I really feel oh, like that's yeah. what it is. Everybody just wants to have that one more thing moment that like Steve Jobs is just, it was the right time and he was the right person and it was the right company, but that's never going to work ever for another person and another company and another product, no matter what it is. But... <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, that is that is funny stuff, man. We should do a supercut of like the most cringeworthy press conferences we can find. That'd be good. I feel that'd like that would be really funny. And, like get us uninvited to some of the, the press conferences. <laughs> that's, that's true. Okay. Worth it. <laughs> Super worth it. But uh, <laughs> but anyway, so that is gonna do it for the stream today. Um, oh, I just saw uh Vima Pro, hello, and Sunny Jimbo. What's up, Sunny Jimbo? And Fire says GGs, man. Yeah, for sure, GGs. This was a lot of fun. Um, thanks to everybody who joined and uh, played with us today, and thanks to everybody who watched. If you are unaware, this is the official autoblog.com live stream um we stream every tuesday and thursday from two o'clock to four o'clock eastern time if you don't know what autoblog is we are a website where uh we talk about automotive news and reviews is what we've been talking about the uh the last little bit here we lots of automotive news coming out of ces we are covering uh all of it all the important stuff it's going to be on autoblog.com so check that out um Sorry about my loud dog. Um, we have come down with age. <laughs> yeah. John, for anybody who doesn't know, John's been telling me that for like four years now. It is, it is, <laughs> it is yet to happen. But, uh, but, uh, yeah, so check out Autoblog for, uh, all kinds of, uh, all the news coming out of CES, all the auto news coming out of CES, anyways, and, uh, yeah. just general automotive news, uh, lots of great coming stuff Coming up on there. soon, like, maybe next week, I'll have a review, a first drive of the, uh, Mercedes Maybach GLS 600, which Ooh. is absolutely insane, is, like, the most, I don't know, <laughs> over-the-top SUV I've driven in, in a long time. Nice. There you go. Um, so keep an eye out for that next week on autoblog.com. Um, we are, you can also find us all over social media. We got Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, TikTok. Um, check us out there. We have a podcast. It's called the Autoblog Podcast that is available anywhere where podcasts are. We, um, we have merch. It's available at redbubble.com slash people slash autoblog, or you can just search for autoblog on redbubble.com, or you can go to the link in our Twitch bio. We have uh, all kinds of stuff. We have, like, T-shirts. Um, we got throw pillows. We have uh, we have washable, uh, reusable face masks. We have... Um, we have uh, like jigsaw puzzles, all kinds of cool stuff on the on the merch store. So check that out. And then um, yeah, thanks again for uh, watching today, everybody. Thanks for thanks for everybody who followed. That is very appreciated. Uh, thanks for joining, John. Do you have any yeah, do you have any parting right. words? Uh, just be excellent to each other, and uh, yeah, keep an eye out for uh, all the. Cool car news coming out of uh, CES and elsewhere. We've got lots of fun stuff planned for this year. Indeed, indeed. And then uh, last but not least, I like to end these by saying if you have a um, like a like a charity or a nonprofit or something that you like, um, donate to them. Or or if if you don't have money to donate, donate some time. Um, volunteering is, uh, super easy and super free to do. So, um, consider doing that. Find an organization that you think helps the world and, uh, consider giving back and helping them out. Um, but yeah, so I think that is going to do it for the stream today. 
So we will uh, we will see you on Tuesday at two o'clock p.m. Eastern time with uh, Dirt Rally 2.0. Adios.